We're just two days away from Florida's primary election where voters can pick their favorite candidate to show up on the November ballot. Now this morning we have Craig Latimer. He's the supervisor of elections for Hillsborough County. Now for most counties, early voting is done, but that's not the case for Pinellas and your county, Hillsborough. That's correct. We still have early voting today from 10 to 6. Um, and Hillsborough will be at 19 different locations. We would just urge people to go to our website, votehillsborough.org, pick the one closest to you. All right, and Tuesday, big day, right? You guys must be incredibly busy. How are you preparing? So we have 270 polling sites on election day. So we've got equipment deployed. We've got people trained. Uh, we'll be ready to go. Um, seven to seven, the polls will be open. We want to remind voters, bring your driver's license or other form of uh, photo signature ID. All right, and how's the turnout? Pre-registration, what are you seeing? The turnout for, for early voting and vote by mail has been fantastic. We've actually already voted over 124,000 people. Yeah. Uh, 35,000 plus have already taken advantage of voting early. Uh, so things are good, but we've got 837,000 registered voters. So there's a few more out there that need to vote. Okay, so for the people coming in on Tuesday, what are some common mistakes? What do you want them to know? Well, look at their sample ballot so they're ready to vote. That's the biggest thing. Make sure that they know what they're gonna vote on. Um, bring that photo signature identification with you and make sure on Tuesday, you have to vote in the precinct that you reside in. Do you see that happening often? By we, we see people have moved and they don't really know where the precinct is. So again, they can go on our website and they can find out where their precinct is or call our office 744-5900. And if they show up at the wrong precinct, tell us what happens. We'll redirect them to the appropriate okay. precinct that they need to vote in. All right, so still no sweat. No, it'll be a great day. All right, well, Florida is a closed primary. Can you? Explain a little bit about what it that is. means. So the, the primary, what we're doing now is you're nominating your candidate to move forward to the general election. So you must be registered in a major party, Democrat or Republican party, to, to put your person forward. But those people that are no party affiliation or another minor party, they have things to vote on too. All the nonpartisan races, the judges, the school board. And we'll actually have a school board race and a judges race decided at this primary. All right, so any major changes this primary? No, your shop. no major changes. We have electronic poll books to check voters in, and then we have the, uh, the paper with the optical scan. Um, so it's, it's an easy way to go. Okay, expecting long lines or? I don't think we're gonna have long lines. I think we'll move people through quickly uh, right. when we're spread out across 270 sites. Yeah, that's convenient. Okay, any last message to our audience here? Um, if you have a vote by mail ballot, it's too late to mail it. You need to drop it at our office, or if you wanna vote, bring it. You can surrender it at the polling site and vote a regular ballot. All right, Craig, thank you so much for your time. We'll thank be you. seeing you again on Tuesday. Thank <laughs> Jasmine. You.